Good morning, good morning, family. It's another day at our prayers that have been coming from the Bible and also prayers that have been coming from me. So, the month of July, this is Angelo here, and the month of July, it's about the prayers that has been done in the Bible and they are great example to us some of them are prayers prophetic prayers that have been declared by those that have prayed them and you know for me i find that passion to to have seen the amount of prayers that have been prayed and that we must be a uh, praying people we must be praying people we must be people of God that really stay in the presence of God because there's always temptation there's always something to come and to sway you away from or to really get you in a place where the enemy wants to put you into captivity so we glorify God this morning and we thank him for his awesome presence in our lives as we press into these prayers we believe God for the impossible. Um, I've started this prayer on Sunday. And I believe I'm just moving as the Lord leads. So the prayer that I'll be doing this morning, it is coming from First Chronicle, First Chronicle 4, 9 to 10. So that's First Chronicle 4, 9 to 10. And it thus reads, and Jabez was more honorable than his brethren. And his mother called his name Jabez, saying, Because I bear him with sorrow. And Jabez called on the God of Israel, saying, Oh, that thou wouldest bless me indeed, and enlarge my cause, and that thine hand might be with me and that thou wouldest keep me from evil that it may may not grieve me and god granted him that which he re he requests he requested and this morning as i read from this book as i read from this book this prayer this morning is much shorter than all the other prayers but i believe it's one of the most powerful prayer one of yeah i believe all the prayers are powerful but can you imagine the it, how short it is and it gets straight to the point he asks god to enlarge his territory and place his hand upon him that no evil can harm him it has covered so many areas in just a few seconds few minutes and we just want to bless god that this morning will be a morning that we see god we see him enlarging our territory because some of us like jabez some of us like Jabez, as the mother said, and Jabez was more honorable than his brethren. And his mother called him his name, Jabez, saying, because I bore him with sorrow. You know, some of us came into this world with such pain and such sorrow. And some of us have lived in whole soul with so much, with so many pain and so much so much pain and sorrow and grief and uh, even now until this moment some of us are still in so much issues that we have no idea how to deal with them we have no idea how to fix them but this morning i'm here to say to someone this prayer if we don't have words these prayer we can utter them in the name of jesus and we can trust god that these prayer can make a difference in our life we thank god this morning for these words that come from the bible as people of god as believers you know we thank god that a legacy has been left behind and that we can count on this legacy and speak the word of god i declare and decree a change in someone's spirit this morning i declare and decree 
good health in the name of Jesus and that the hand of God will reach out and touch you wherever you are in your situation this morning in the name of Jesus. If you're going through financial difficulty, if you're going through marital problem, if you're going through work issues, if you're going to mighty God, if you're going through dispute bereavement whatever 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 that is taking place in your life this morning and you come in contact with this video if you feel trapped if you feel a heavy burden that is upon you this morning we trust the living god that he is more than able to relieve you of that burden in the mighty name of jesus christ of nazareth so we thank god for the word this morning and we say thanks be to god for his word because his word shall be a lamp unto our feet and a light unto our path. I shall be singing a small part of this song this morning. You can only be blessed and of peace and sweet rest as you heal them your body and so and he says you have long for sweet peace and for faith to increase you have earnestly fervently prayed but you can not have rest or be perfectly blessed until all on the altar is laid. Is your soul to the one and only God the one and only wise God truly the beginning and the end God a God that holds the key to death and to hell according to revelation father we give you thanks this morning for your people we thank you for your grace and your mercy we thank you for the comforter that you have left behind and so robber koshada we shall not be comfortless. Mighty God, we shall not be comfortless this morning. May you move in those stagnation situation, mighty God. May you move in those stagnant situation. May you move in those dark places this morning and may you God uncover that which is covered in the name of Jesus father we praise you this morning we exalt you in the name of Jesus father those that come to this channel for for for, for our word or for for this comfort in their mind God we pray for them this morning we pray that God you will touch the minds we touch oh God almighty and bring healing to their mind body and soul this morning father we exalt you this morning we shall back you in the name of Jesus and God 
I pray that your peace that surpasses all understanding will rest upon each and every one. Whether they have watched this video or not, Father, we pray as long as they are a part of the ministry, a part of the channel, Father, we pray for them and we pray that God, you will, you will just guide their each and every steps this morning. May your provision be with them in the name of Jesus and may you unlock the doors that need to be unlocked. May you, God, open up their spiritual eyes and spiritual ears, oh God, and bring them into that place of healing and deliverance in the name of Jesus. Enter the schools, enter, oh God Almighty, the different places, oh God, that need healing, oh God, this morning, our children need healing. May you touch them in the name of Jesus. Our teachers need healing, our leaders need healing, mighty God. Our family members need healing in the name of Jesus. And God, we place each and every one, our country, oh God Almighty, need healing. We put them before you, Lord God. And we pray that your power of healing will be upon this land in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Amen. I thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you, brothers and sisters in Christ, for tuning in and supporting that which the Lord is doing on this channel. We give God glory, honor, and praise, and we put all in his hands and in his cares. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Amen. God bless you. God keep you. May his face continue to shine upon you. And the peace that surpasses all understanding will be with you. See, feel, and see the vision that God has given unto you. Don't give up. Don't give in. Keep pressing. God bless.